Greetings. Welcome back to EastEnders Spoilers Channel. If it's the first time you come to my channel then our channel make videos to predicts, summarizes and gossips about the soaps TV shows. In this video, we are going to discuss about the EastEnders, Ian Beale and Bep Di Marco returns to destroy Sharon Mitchell. EastEnders stalwart Ian Beale could be returning to Walford with a very familiar face as he and former resident of the square, Bep Di Marco, seek revenge on Sharon Mitchell. Ian played by Adam Woodyatt hasn't been seen on EastEnders for several months, having done a vanishing act when Sharon tried to kill him for playing a part in her son Denny Rickman's death. The ruthless businessman's mother, Kathy Beale has been desperate for answers but so far, no one knows where the BBC soap stalwart has gone. However, a new theory could see him team up with Bep off-screen and the duo return together to see if they can take down their mutual enemy, Sharon, once and for all. Bep was a character on the weeknight serial drama from 1998 to 2002 and he was at the center of some explosive storylines. Not only was he involved with Phil Mitchell and his brother Grant Mitchell, he also colluded with Steve Owen in some dodgy dealings. The former Walford resident became a ruthless businessman in his own right and got quite the reputation on the square. He once owned the club which is now in the hands of Ruby Allen before he made his exit from the show. However, he left it in Sharon's capable hands so he will surely want answers as to how she came to lose the establishment. Off-screen, Ian could have filled Bep in on all the failings in business his ex-wife has made over the past 20 years. Determined to get even with Sharon for almost killing him, having the former character of the BBC soap as an ally could work in the ruthless businessman's favor. Recent scenes on the weeknight serial drama have seen the former landlady secure the deeds to a local gym to begin her new fitness venture. But will her plans be thwarted as her ex-husband returns with a plan to make sure she will never succeed again? The actor who played Bep, Michael, 50, has expressed interest in returning to the role he once left two decades ago. Speaking on Wednesday's edition of Loose Women, the former soap star said, the demographic of the audience now, you've got the 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s. Most people who watch EastEnders now I think are in their older years because they've been watching it since they were children. So I think for Bep to go back would be fantastic. If he does, if they want him to go back, then I'm available. We shall see, he teased so could viewers be seeing the return of not one but two icons very soon. Taking to Twitter, Fans have already expressed their interest in Bep's comeback, with one writing, they were talking about this on Loose Women but I had the feeling they were just putting the idea out there. With all due respect, that is scraping the barrel a bit. I am just surprised they haven't discovered Reg Cox DIDNT die after all, he just assumed the identity of Phil Mitchell, another posted. Whilst a third shared, I think he is gorgeous, a fourth commented, oh my god. Is this actually true really? Following Ian's exit earlier this year, there has been no inclination given as to when he will return to the fold. As for Sharon, she no longer owns the Queen Vic after selling the pub back to Mick Carter and his wife, Linda Carter. The soap stalwart has also had to bid farewell to her biological father Gavin Sullivan who recently passed away. And to top it all off, she has a half-brother in newcomer Zach Hudson who she knew nothing about so could being the victim of a revenge plot drive her out of town. So that's all we want to talk about the EastEnders, Ian Beale and Bep Di Marco returns to destroy Sharon Mitchell. If you like our content and want to support the channel or watch more videos like this, do not mind to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so that you not miss any of these. Have a great one, goodbye.